been living with diabetes for 33 years now. Also been a dialysis patient for 12. Before dialysis, like a normal teenager growing up, very active, played basketball, played football, played tennis, you know, very active, like I said. And of course, uncontrolled diabetes when I got a little older led to my, my, my condition, which is dialysis. I'm also partially blind in my left eye. And um, dialysis has been challenging. Like I said, it's three times a week, four hours per session, right? So the challenges for me is not being able to be able to play sports anymore. Um, because of dialysis, you know, my bones are very brittle, so I have to be very careful with contact sports. Financially has affected me because of dialysis, I'm unable to work because like I said, it takes three, three days of my week, so I'm unable to work. But the financial strain has been on my parents. And um, like a day like today, we still struggle in finance, you know, and getting my medication. It's just not only the treatment, but medication that has to go along with the dialysis. It's been challenging for the past 12 years. Emotionally, it has taken a strain on me, not being able to eat, you know, like normal persons. My fluid intake is also limited. Being on the machine is very tedious. Um, of course, being stuck by two needles every session. So there's that aspect of the fear of needles. I have changed the way I look at things, you know, for my mindset to be much stronger and coping with this dialysis for, like I said, for 12 years. And um, it's been challenging, but thanks to the support that I have, the family and the friends that I have has been very helpful along my journey. So my advice, I would tell persons again, you know, change the way you look at things and the things you look at change. You know, I'm a DJ, so this doesn't stop me from living. You know, I still live, I still represent the St. Lucia on the International Diabetes Federation. I'm the Vice President for the Diabetes for Youth, and I'm also the PRO for St. Lucia Renal Association.